Hi there, this is Ken Tao, the director of MCAT programming from the Prospective Doctor team. In this video, we're going to answer the question, how can I improve my MCAT CARS score? I like the science sections. The CARS section doesn't require any science content. So for many students, they feel that there isn't anything for them to study for the MCAT CARS section. However, that's not the case. And here we're going to describe three things that you can do to improve your MCAT CARS score. The first is, read the MCAT passages with enthusiasm. If you're starting to read the MCAT passages and all you're thinking is, this passage is so boring, I don't want to read this, then it's going to be very hard for you to engage yourself with the passage and understand it. Remember, every MCAT passage is written by an author with a particular audience. So try to consider yourself as one of the members of the audience and in doing so, you can read the passage with enthusiasm and that's going to give you a better understanding of the passage and then allow you to get more questions correct. The second thing is when you read the passage, focus on the main idea of the passage as well as the author's tone. Now, a lot of us who are preparing for the MCAT are used to reading scientific textbooks. And when you're reading these texts, you're typically focused on all the details and the facts. And that's exactly how you don't want to read for the MCAT car section. You really want to focus on the main idea and the author's tone. So as you read the text, after each paragraph, you should be asking yourself, what did I learn from this paragraph? What was the main idea of this paragraph? By the time you finish reading the entire passage, you should know what is the main idea of the passage, and you should also have an idea of what was the author's tone. Did the author like or agree with whatever topic they were writing about, or is this something that they disagreed or were opposed to? And by understanding these two things, you're going to be able to get more MCAT CARS questions correct. The third thing is you want to attack the answer choices. Remember on the MCAT, you can either look for the correct answer or you can find three bad answer choices. Both ways work. You're going to be able to get the questions correct. So with the CARS section, eliminating answer choices is going to be a great strategy for you to use. And a couple common ways we can eliminate answer choices is answer choices that are extreme as well as answer choices that don't have any support from the passages. So keep this in mind, and again, you're going to be able to get more questions correct on the car section. So hopefully you found this video helpful, and you will be able to keep these three things in mind as you're doing MCAT cars passages. And if you have any questions for me, feel free to, to drop us a comment in this video, or contact us at prospectivedoctor.com or medschoolcoach.com. Thanks for checking out that video. I hope you found it helpful. For even more, subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our blog. And remember, if you need help through the MCAT, admissions, or USMLE, Med School Coach has you covered.